All right, quick video here. We're gonna talk about the pros and cons of dating younger women. I'm 46. Natasha's half my age. You've probably seen her in my OnlyFans content or my YouTube channels over the years. Um, what's it like dating older women, younger women? I've done both, same age women. Pros and cons. Let's start to the younger women one. The pros are, the pros are less baggage. All right. In general, obviously there's exceptions to the rule, but this is you know, the, rule, the exceptions that make the rule. In general, we're gonna have less emotional baggage, less physical baggage, relationship baggage, financial baggage, health baggage, kid baggage, baggage in general. And if baggage is what you want, then that's okay. And baggage doesn't make someone, you know, better or worse or, it's just different, all right? Just like, you know, I like these shoes, but some people don't like these shoes, okay? It doesn't mean these shoes are bad or worse. It's just like, maybe they're bad for you, but they're good for me, so I'm just saying. Um, but for me, I like a girl who's a lot of freedom, all right? Because I have a very, very free life. I don't have kids, I don't have debt, I don't have a mortgage. Right. Every single day I wake up and I get to do whatever the fuck I want to do. It's been like that for the last 20 years, okay? So I'm just used to that lifestyle. So I need a girl who's free to be able to join me in my lifestyle, okay? Now, that, because I enjoy having, you know, a full-time girlfriend around, you know, that's just how I've always been the last 15 years or so, and 50, flat off, almost 15 years. So that's what I prefer. Um, some people say, hey, you're scratching the back of your neck, means you're lying. Now I've actually got an itch. <laughs> Maybe it's the lying itch. But I, I prefer, I, okay, camera cut out. So I just prefer the company of women. So I need to have someone who's who wants to one, live with me, and most women are looking for a relationship. Most women want to move in with you, you know, and for my girlfriends, I have not moved in pretty much on the first first day, the first week, you, you come and live with me. And then that way I'll know if you're compatible, all right? And if you're not compatible, then you know, you're free to go, and you're free to go anytime you want. Because I believe in having that freedom on that. People are just not stuck. They can just go. If it's not working out, you go. We'll keep it civil. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll try to anyway. And, uh, well, I will. But I might, you know. Anyway, mistakes were made. Um, so, yeah, it's just, you know, the pros, man. That freedom there. That's the big one for me. Having the freedom. No kids, no debt, no mortgage, no baggage, no crazy ex-partner, no crazy ex-husband, blah, blah, blah. All right. Uh, let's talk about my current partner Natasha it's been you know she came I feel we first met when she was about 18 and uh, so she never had a she's never had like a you know a real boyfriend she's had you know normal high school romances and stuff like that but not, not a, what I would have called a real boyfriend what somewhere you're living together you're doing things together things like that um, so that was great you know so I got to be her first on, on the, that and first for many things um, and it's great I love to do that people say look at you you're just you're just, just like you're using your power and celebrity your money to like influence young groom young women who are very attractive and and yeah that's right and I do that for their benefit all right and do you think she would be with me if I wasn't didn't have money and financial stability and emotional stability and a large dong and game and experience and do you think she would no no she wouldn't okay there's always something for something out there and the main people who hate on you as a guy if you're dating someone younger than you is the Karens out there, or the other, the younger guys who are, hey, you're, you're scalping our chicks, it's competition. But hey, there's millions of people out there, okay? There's plenty for everyone. If you put the work in, you'll become a person of value. Just as I wasn't a person of social market, sexual market value when I was, Natasha's idea, what did I, what did I, have, what did I have to offer a woman back then? Other than boyish looks, a nice heart, and a dong, but not much sexual experience how much to offer so men you're based on what you can provide and how you can make a woman feel okay that's 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 that that's right there if you know you know so another what are the other pros for is health you know Tasha's very healthy you know it's pros man there's so many pros just the fitness thing the health thing the, the minimal baggage thing she's like I get to experience my life again because I get to show her things that I did like cycling or running or travel or like I get to take her to places and, and watch her reaction to trying new foods or going to new places or seeing new things that I've saw back when I was that age and I get to re relive that and that, that feels fucking awesome as well and I get to share good moments with people and it's not just you know Natasha I get to do that with a lot of people out there you know over the years especially with YouTube I get to introduce concepts and good things to people out there so that's a bonus for me 
but staying back on topic to date younger women um, they just got more zest for life right they got more passion they got more energy right they're they're hornier right they're, their hormones are priming okay they're just priming okay now obviously that's there are exceptions to the rule but I'm just saying that yeah, that's the element there they just they're the zigs it's just you know yeah, it's and well, we can't start on YouTube, but uh, certain other things on YouTube. But you know, what I'm just saying, all right? The 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 does, all right. Now, the, what's the cons? The cons of dating someone younger. Like the real cons are, um, I'll have to get you back in that one. Hang on, just, uh, let me have a think about it.